Okay, first thing to do is to prepare one cubic centimetre of sucrose solution into each of five small tubes. Here we go. So there's one in there. Then we need to fill up the small tube with yeast suspension. So we'll fill up the tube with yeast. We're going to fill it right to the top. Here we go. That's it. You can try and make sure you mix it a little bit as you do it. Then we've got a technique now to get this inside an audience test tube. So we pop it over the top like that. Take a glass rod and poke the tube up inside. That's it. Then quickly invert it. And then you'll notice you've got a small bubble at the top here. That's your starting height of bubble. Okay. And you'll need to measure that starting height of the bubble, which looks to be round about six millimetres. And we repeat that for each of the temperatures. So we're going to have uh, one on ice, we're going to do one at 20 degrees, 30 degrees, 40 degrees and 50 degrees. After 10 minutes, we need to measure the height of the bubble in each of the tubes, which hopefully you can see here. That's around about 33 millimetres. Do the same and then measure each of your other tubes. We can calculate the results by um, taking away the starting uh, bubble height from the finishing, the end bubble height. So we'll have three, four, 24, 28, and 32 millimeters. There'll be, and then you, you need to plot these numbers against the temperatures.